Hello guys, I hope you are doing really really well. Today I have with me the new Samsung Galaxy Tab S8 Plus and in this video I will show you amazing S Pen tips and tricks. Okay, so the first tip is related to the air action. So I just take uh, the pen, the S Pen away from the screen and I just press and hold uh, this uh, pen button. Okay, so once I do it, okay i press and hold and you will see i didn't touch the screen and this will open a create note option for me so now i can create note i can write down anything on this okay i just have to touch the screen i just use uh, this pen button over here okay and then i just press and hold and then it open uh, a new note for me so here i can create my notes as well okay so the second tip is related to the air action as well so for example example if uh, you move uh, your pen in the air not uh, on the tablet just like this okay so you can see it open the recent uh, tabs uh, for me okay so for example I open my favorite multitasking combination okay so you can see it is ready now so I can use all the functions properly I can write down if I want to write something okay so I can browse the uh, internet okay so video is over here everything is working perfectly fine if I want to move some image okay so I can move the image as well okay so this is how I can use this air action as well so guys the next air action is related to the camera so for example I turn on the camera okay so I can use this pen button to take the picture okay so I just press it okay so you can see it is now take uh, easily it can take the picture okay and now for example I um, press and hold it and move to this side it will change uh, to video mode okay so like that you can see now it changed to video mode again if I move it like that it will uh, show me more options okay so I can select any uh, option if I want to go back to video okay I will just uh, press the button and I just do it like this okay and then for the photo and then for this portrait okay so I can do uh, these options okay and uh, for example I move uh, to the photo okay if I double press the button okay so it will uh, change uh, the uh, the camera okay towards the back camera so because it is like this so for example if I move so you can see it is showing the back camera okay so if I double press if I press again double time two times so it will uh, turn on the selfie camera so this is how uh, you can operate uh, the camera from uh, your S Pen okay so the next uh, feature is the uh, air action as well it is related to the zigzag mode so for example I press the button in the air and I move it like this my pen it will open uh, the Excel for me okay so for example if I want to work on Excel sheet okay office Excel I can uh, do that as well the next thing is related to this S Pen uh, charging if you want to charge this S Pen you can put at the back side of this tablet so there is a place okay so you have to uh, move uh, your pen tip towards the camera like this and then just do it like this and once you do it it will show you the icon over here as well okay so for example I remove it and then I put it back okay like uh, this okay so now you can see it is showing you the uh, percentage the battery percentage of the S Pen as well and it is uh, showing you the icon that it is connected properly to your tablet okay you can also connect your S Pen over here on the top like this okay so you can see over here you can also do it like this on top as well the next uh, feature is related uh, to the internet browser with the air action so for example uh, if you press the button one time it will move you back in the internet browser okay so you can see I'm moving back if you uh, press it two times okay it will move forward uh, in the forward direction in your website so for example if you are searching something if you want to go back just press this uh, pen button okay so you can see over here this pen button over here you just press it one time okay so if I press it one time it will go back okay and then if I press it two time it will move forward okay so this is how you can use this feature so guys the next feature is related to unlocking your tablet with S Pen button so for example I lock my tablet like this and now I want to unlock the tablet with S Pen button I just press and hold this button okay so I just press and hold okay 
and you see the tablet is unlocked now I can use my tablet okay so you can see we just uh, using by just pressing and holding uh, this pen button okay so you can see over here okay the tablet is unlocked now and I can use my tablet so the next feature is uh, related uh, to the advanced features okay so for example uh, if your pen is away okay so it will give you a kind of a notification so for example if uh, you go to the settings then you go into advanced features then go to S Pen okay and then here is option uh, which is says warn if S Pen uh, is left behind okay so you can see warn if S Pen is left behind show a warning if you leave your S Pen behind and walk away with your tablet while the screen is off so you have to turn it on okay so always turn it on it is really safe for your S Pen so uh, it will give you a warning if your S Pen is not uh, attached to your tablet or it is away from your tablet so it will give you a warning so the next feature is related to the media and it is really interesting so I open some kind of a video okay so for example I open this video now use your pen button uh, to pause this video okay so I press it one time the button okay so you see the video is paused uh, uh, if you want to play it again just press it again so you can see the video is now playing if you want to move uh, to another video okay just move it like this okay wait I will show you so now another video open if you move it like this okay the previous video will open so guys you can also uh, take notes while watching a video I will show you how so for example I open a video so for example like this video I open okay and now if uh, you are watching a lecture and you want to make a notes so what you can do is just press and hold this uh, pen button okay it will open a new note uh, for you so you can create your notes okay but there is an issue you can see it is blocking the video behind so what you can do is just press this blue bar over here okay and select this option which is for opacity so just reduce it like this okay just decrease it like that and then you can see the video behind is now showing and you can still take your notes okay so okay okay so you can see it is really helpful and then uh, when you finish your work you can simply just close your notes it will automatically save so the next feature is related to writing on lock screen so for example I lock my screen and I want to take some notes I am in a hurry so what I will do is I just uh, press and hold the pen button and I tap on the screen two times okay so like this okay so you can see the note uh, is open I can write on my screen okay you can see over here and you can easily save it you just have to use this option of save over here it will save for you okay the next feature is related to a uh, smart select so I open uh, some website okay so for example I open this website and I want to take uh, any image uh, from the website or any text okay a specific image or specific text I can easily take it okay so for example I want to take this image okay like this one and I want to capture only this image what I will do I use the air command option you see there is an icon just select it once you select it it is showing you the smart select option just select it like this and then you see there are different option I select this rectangle and then I just select it like this okay like that okay so now you can see it is uh, selected now now you can share it okay you can save it if uh, you want to save it into your gallery and then later you can use this image if you want to see where it is saved I go in the image and you can see over here the image is over here okay so you can see and now you can use in, in your notes as well okay uh, the next option is related to Samsung notes which is really really helpful for the students so I open the Samsung notes okay so in the Samsung note there are a lot of uh, tools I will make a separate video about it so there are different pen option pen pencils different kind of markers okay so there are different options as well so you can write on your notes you can make your notes there is a eraser option as well the highlighter option so this is the highlighter then we have the eraser option 
okay and then we also have the uh, uh, the uh, fix shapes options which is really really amazing so for example if you want to draw some shape it will make it neat for you okay so you can see over here so this is really really uh, helpful for the students okay so you can see you can create different shapes you can also edit your pdf files over here so for example i have my previous pdf files for example i open this pdf file i can edit it okay and then you can see this is a pdf file you can simply uh, highlight something you can write on your pdf okay you can write on your pdf okay if you want to use the highlighter for example like this one okay you can easily highlight something so you can see so there are different options you can use uh, in the samsung notes and then there is a multitasking um, option as well you, you can select your favorite multitasking apps for example you open the samsung notes okay and then you want to open in the split screen so you can see there is uh, your samsung notes and the other apps working here as well so i open the internet from here okay so you can see internet is working this one is also working you can open one more uh, uh, app as well okay for example if you want to use youtube okay or you want to uh, open my files i select it and i put it like this okay and then you can see it is also working all the three apps are working perfectly fine okay so you can use this for multitasking as well uh, the next feature is related to writing on the calendar just select this air command see this option of write on calendar just select it and then simply if you want to write something on a specific date okay so for example you want to write for this date you can easily write it okay so there are a lot of option you can edit your calendar with the s pen really amazing and then simply you can save it like this the next feature is related to the edge panel so there are a lot of option in the edge panel so you can see there are different apps you can open uh, this edge panel you can also pin this uh, panel from here just go in these three lines okay and then you can pin it so once you pin it whenever uh, you open uh, any app for example i open clock so the edge panel will uh, be here so you can use this uh, edge panel option as well if you want to unpin it you can unpin and then if you want to take this tray out you can see the edge panel is over here you can add more apps in this edge panel just go over here go all apps so once you select it you see there are all apps option also available and if you go to the edge panel if you scroll it like this you will have more option you will have more apps option so you can see you can create animation you can create oval rectangle shape you can pin to screen then there are more option okay related to weather okay then we have this uh, uh, related something to uh, campus compass okay and then we have the reminder option okay and then whatever you copy it also appear over here and then you can simply drag it to your notes as well so guys this is for today's video i hope you like the video i hope you enjoy the video so please do subscribe to my channel guys thank you very much